Every single week in the NFL, unbelievable plays happen that make us leave our seats. Today, I'll be attempting to recreate five of the best plays from NFL Week 11. And we're going to be starting it off with Seattle's very own Jackson Smith and Jigba's Moss over two Rams defenders. Up first, we got to find the formation. It's going to be one of these. Here we go. That's perfect. Classical verticals. Let me set up this defense real quick. We got Jalen Johnson and we got Jordan Fowler. Okay, here we go. Maybe we get our one trip post. We caught it. Yeah, let's move on, please. No. Now I'm just going to run this play how it is. We got to block Aaron Donald. Good job there. Oh, once we get a catch, which it might take a couple. I mean, this is a rookie. Give him a little bit of slack here, people. The other thing that I forgot, I want to get like a little bit of a rollout and then a little bit of a throw just like that. Why are we burning? By the way, people, you all know what to do. Put your predictions for week number 12 top plays down below. If you're able to properly predict that play correctly, you'll get to end up in the video. So don't waste any time. Oh, shoot, didn't double team Aaron Donald, but we had a second guy get in anyways. And what, dude, you're going with one hand? Like, buddy, calm down, okay? This is a little bit silly right now. Oh, jeez. I don't know if I can... Yes! 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 That was so good! We're going kickoff for play number four. Now, you know I enjoy recreating plays that are a little bit different, and this is what I'm talking about. Reggie Gilliam, a fullback. Huge hit stick force fumble off the opening kickoff. So first things first, I got to make sure that he's on the field, which... He's not. Of course he isn't. Okay, we should be good now. I just subbed him in at running back number two. He said number two. Let's see what his hit power is. 46 hit power, 49 tackling. What did I sign myself up for? This is good. There he is right there. Now, where I kind of like this is, is that it is on a former top play getter with Tayshawn Gibson. Where are we at? Oh, wait, is he down there? Oh, 52. I got to learn these players' names. I might have to put a second controller on people so I could get on the right guy and start leaving. Oh, of course, we're on the right guy, and he just kneels the ball down. Are they going to give me the right guy? That's 41. That's us. Dude, we got to make it down there quicker than... Oh, we just missed them. I can't get off these people. Wait, no, I missed completely. We got to get a tackle first. Just build up some faith in ourselves. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to have to rely on the block shed. That's holding, and they just scored a touchdown. <laughs> Oh, man. I can just imagine the Jets doing that in real life. This is kind of a terrible situation for me right Bye. now. Look at this. Where are you going? I might be better off just letting him just go down by himself. This is going to be way more difficult than I thought. Did I mention that I'm using a fullback right now? And his tacklings? What is... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got closer to tackling my own guy than I did Gibson there. We're down there. Oh, we got to tackle our first one. Wait. Oh, that was only a half tackle. Why you gotta ruin things for me? Whoa, 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 whoa. Here we go, here we go. All right, new strategy. I'm coming from the nether realm, and now he runs it left. Oh my gosh, wait, 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 wait. close. Ooh, we were so close. Beautiful. Nope, terrible, terrible. We're going the wrong way. I have one thing to say about that. So it turns out with all the different variables, this play was pretty difficult to get. Let's fast forward quite a bit to my first real good attempt. Give me my first tackle, first hit stick, first fumble, first recovery all at one time. <gasps> yes! Wait, tell me that. No, we didn't pick it up. Did we even hit him? I can't tell if that was me or if that was Damar Hamlin. What does it matter? We didn't recover it. My fingers are just crossed that Gibson's carrying isn't the greatest. Uh-oh, one-on-one. One-on-one! He's dead! Come on! Reggie Gilliam! Four times to the Jets. Bass sends it down the way, and it's going to be Gibson with the hands on it. He had his hands on it again the last time they met. And the ball comes out at the end, and it's recovered by the backup tight end, Morris. On to play number three. Who do you think it is, Buccaneers or 49ers? Tell you one thing, it's not the Buccaneers. We got Brandon Ayuk, 76-yard touchdown. Laser from Brock Purdy. Let's do it. Shock wide receiver option. 
perfect play. Mr. Jamel Dean will be in coverage. We're going to see what Brandon Ayuk is looking like here. Whoa, buddy. That bl Maybe I don't want to bring a blitzer like that. We'll try this cover one Robert Press. See if that works. Oh, I think that will work. Brock Purdy. What was that, sir? I have absolutely no clue. Maybe never do that again. I think the press coverage is going to be perfect though, because we've got to drop a dot like right over the top. Oh, boy. I don't know if there's a speed advantage or not for Ayuk. It might be like really close. Oh, he's definitely faster for sure. But I tell you what, I'm hoping that he's fast enough. Well, right there, we didn't beat him. Oh, boy. We're going to try different routes with these other guys like George Kittle. Just get that safety kind of away. Fudge. I was a little bit too deep for the throw. I'll say that. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. We're getting past him, which is awesome. Now, that kind of actually worked. No kidding. Wow. We got open. We got open. Out of my way, son. No. Get the heck out of here. That was actually so good. We're kind of hot with the plays right now. 76 yards from Brandon Ayuk. The start of Brock Purdy's time as the quarterback, but George Kittle's kind of turned into that security blanket for him. Lots Ayuk here. He's got it. He beats Dean, and he takes it the distance. And again, another really well-played football by Brock. We are on to play number two, looking better than ever. How about Jalen Warren's 74-yard halfback toss taken to the house? As a Steeler fan, we are not going to talk about anything else from this game, okay? <laughs> We definitely have quite a few halfback tosses to choose from. It's, it's really just which one's going to look the best. We got that random 4-3 defense on the field. The Zeridis, okay. What do we do? What is happening already? This is supposed to be a highlight. Actually, what's happening? And how are we breaking that tackle off? What the heck? Normally, I get these. I'm like, oh, dude, I can get one. I can break one off eventually. Look at, like, what type of blocking are we getting? This is next to nothing trash garbage. Really, it just comes down to us getting a lucky defensive play to go up against. There we go. <laughs> We got a couple yards. By the way, Madden, is, he's not super disrespectful. Let's get Jalen Warren up a little bit higher than an 80 overall. This man deserves it, okay? He's going to keep proving it. Look at him. He's always falling forward. He's always breaking tackles. He's always stiff arming. I'm vouching for him. He is the next Austin Eckler. That looked like the best defensive setup so far. By the way, Zadarius Smith, I don't know how or why he's struggling tackling us. I'm not complaining, though. We just got to run around them, and we don't got to worry about them being in the second level. We just got to get the right people. I don't know if I should be ID. <laughs> the amount of times I've seen that exact thing happen is stupid. I think they feel bad for him because Darius is coming in unblocked, so he just misses the tackle automatically. This is rough. I'll tell you what. I also don't know what his speed is. It's probably low 90s at best. Wow. Or more, even him at, at linebacker. Trust me, I know all about him. 89 speed. There it is again. Wait, we're going to try a different camera angle. Maybe this would be sick. Yeah, yeah, we can see Jalen Warren get clobbered close up. Great. The amount of pain that I'm putting him through right now. Here it goes again. Drop a like right now if you think Madden needs to come up with some new animations. Or just maybe make this game so it's not so animation based in general. How about that? That would be sick. So yeah, I think it's pretty clear that we're strong struggling right now in the beginning. Luckily, there were a couple plays where we caught some sparks, though. Oh! First off, why was Miles Garrett there? Second off, he was the only guy, and we had it. Don't get me wrong, we still had a ton of fails. Yeah, okay, of course. I like that, I like that, I like that. That's better. That's so much better. Oh, this is getting annoying. Oh, 76. Dog, dog. Help me get somebody. He just decides to get no one. Hilarious. There we go again. Okay. As if I haven't seen that a hundred times already. That seems... Oh my gosh. Oh my... You know, I'm such a disappointment. Wait, 76, 76. He's being stupid. Holy moly, he actually got a block. Yes! Yes! We got the full 74! And that right there... Play number two. Cleveland is allowing less than 13 first downs per game. The third fewest through nine games since 1991. Jalen Warren's got a big game. Warren streaking down the sideline. And they break the seal. Touchdown, Steelers. We are now on to my number one play of the week. Y'all know that I'm a sucker for trick plays. And the Tennessee Titans pulled it off to perfection. We have a wildcat shovel pass. Lateral back to Will Levis, who found DeAndre Hopkins. 43 yards downfield. By the way, if anybody guessed D-Hop for the top play, congratulations. You made it in the video. And of course, don't forget, if you want a chance to end up in next week's video, reply to my comment. Guess who you think is going to get the number one.
number one play. Now, I know there's Wildcat, but I don't think there's the Wildcat that we need. So we're going to put Derrick Henry, quarterback. We got the main man, Will Levis. We're going to put him at receiver. And we got to get Ty J Spears. I hope I said that right. He's at 79 overall, huh? Wow. Literally one overall less than Jalen Warren. How does that make sense? Okay, anyway. So the first thing I got to do is find part of the play that we need. That Jet touch pass is actually so clean. Maybe I shouldn't have switched Derrick Henry's position. Scratch everything that I did for a second. We're resetting everyone's positions. So yeah, this is actually great. This is perfect. This is a play that we're going to have to piece together. Let me just see what Will Levis does. Because, okay, he goes down and blocks. All right, so what we're going to do is I'm going to toss in a second controller here. We're going to hike it with the... Wait, did that hike it? No, this one hikes it. Guys, you, you'll never understand unless you try this by yourself. And then I'll tell you what else else. This play is going to look so good. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I don't know what I'm doing. Which one am I... So, which one of you guys is trying to come over here and help me with this? I kid you not. And boom. What are we doing that for? Tell me how that makes sense. This is like the most huh? simple of things. <laughs> Makes so much sense. Boom. <gasps> that was close. That was close. It's signs of hope that we need. The ball just goes wherever. I wouldn't be surprised if it ends up hitting me in the head and I don't even have a chance. <sighs> Why do we stop? Nope. 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 It's safe to say from here the frustration continued. Why? Somebody tell me. But eventually, we got it. Oh my gosh, we actually got it. Literally didn't even think that was possible. And then the other part of this play... So we have to get is this Will Levis launching a bomb down, and we got to catch one. Okay, I hope this actually works. We got to be right. <sighs> we got to get a block, of course. So what I want to be doing is running this way, and then sending it to the end zone. We got to be Yoink. a single cut. <laughs> he dies for that. Oh heck yeah, this is perfect. Okay, send it, Levis. Now catch it, Hopkins. My excitement levels for this are like off the charts, though. I I'm telling you what, dude. Once we get this. We're gonna look back and say, yo, this was a dime piece. Yes, yeah, so I got Derrick Henry there on the other controller just to pretend like I have a friend to help me with this. All right, we're gonna do a high ball from Levis. Uh-oh, that is so overthrown. Oh, it almost went through for three. Sending on, oh, it's not in the end zone. Whoa, that would have been insane. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. I hate this game. Ever say that before? Hey, everybody. Yeah, this is my first try at this. Totally. Oh, dude, we caught it. That's a touchdown. Oh, let's roll this play out. Here's Henry Wildcat. They get it back to Levis. Levis going to put some air under it. Towards the end zone. It's caught. Hopkins. Touchdown. So Tennessee with a little bit of a magic trick. 43-yard strike from Levis. Hopefully you all enjoyed this week's top plays. If you did, a like is appreciated. And also, don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed what you've seen. There's an entire playlist of this series throughout the whole NFL season. I'm ending things here. With that said, you're the best. God bless. Don't forget to keep them first from your boy. I'm out. Peace. Oh, yeah. Yesterday, we dropped another brand new unemployed video on our second channel. You should totally go watch it. It's a good one. You won't be disappointed. See you over there.